Hello everyone and welcome back to Kronos Plays Elden Ring. Today we... Oh, we're going up here. How are we going to get there? That's a good question. And then we're probably going to go over here because that seems dope. Um, is there an easy way just down from here? Because we've been down before. So I'm assuming I could just fall down. Though I cannot fall down. Oh, it's a beast man. Oh, I could fall down here? Yes? Yeah, okay, cool. Hello? One second. I see a treasure. I see a treasure. It's mine. Yo! Ooh, explosions, huh? Troll golden sword, huh? Look, I'm coming up here. That's what you get. You also get that as well. Y'all have any stuff? Aside from this lag that I'm... Oh, god damn it, Pumpkin Man. Why are you here? I guess he's selling again. <laughs> I miss her. You know, been a while. Still have no idea how to advance her quest. Oh god. Coming through. Coming through. There we go. Goodbye. Do a quick little looksy loo down here and actually just fall down, because why not? Uh huh. Oh no, you're not going nowhere, buddy. Thank you. Blood blade. A lot of crabs, huh? Should go get them some shampoo. Ha 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 ha! Funny joke. The hell are you? Oh, you're one of those guys. Get back here and die like an undead ghost thing. Stop smoking on me. Second hands hope is like a really horrible thing to do. Hello? Oh, this must be that thing, that cave we saw. Okay, we'll open it. And we'll get the telepad to it. And then we're gonna get in there. Get in there! <laughs> Don't wanna die! Yeah, exactly. He's pissed. Understandable. Ooh, item. So we'll go down this way because this way always has treasure. This way does not have treasure. Oh my god. <laughs> really? Okay. That's great. Thank you for nothing. I mean, I'm not going to go through this place just yet. I'll probably have to switch over to my, um, my big old club to deal with the things here, which is fine. It's been a while since I've leveled that thing up, I think, right? Where is it? Big old club. Uh, it's level 14. Uh, you know, maybe... Switch this over a little bit? That's kind of cool. Has bleed. It's kind of my thing. Hmm, I wonder if I get poison on that club. Could we have two? Could we have poison and bleed on that club? Huh. Shit, maybe. Do you think? I uh, ow. Oh, you got rot? You're an ass. You're also dead. 
Can I have your stuff, please? Thank you. I wouldn't mind be able to cause rot. I, I can't do that yet. Honestly, that kind of seems overpowered if I could do that. So let me do that. Uh, Surpuses vial, black key bolts. Um, was that a talisman? Maybe. I didn't see where it went. I know it does show that. On the items? Oh, it's right here. It eliminates all sound made by wearing by the wearer's movements. Oh. Huh. That's cool. Yeah, no, that's actually pretty cool. That is so poison. Like I can taste that poison. Oh, I see the trees. And then there's the slugs. And there's an item right there. Oh, now it's raining poison. I'm actually really glad it's not raining poison, because that would be just awful. Please don't put that in the next <laughs> friggin' Dark Souls, Bloodborne, or Elden Ring game you make. Are those basilisks? Ah. Oh. Okay. It was a little mean. This place seems really big. Like, there was no guidance from the grace leading us here, so it's not like a... What's it called? Legacy Dungeon? Are those called? Are those all called Legacy Dungeons? I don't really know what they're called. I've heard the term thrown around at this point. Um, shade... Shaded Castle. Don't fall. We'll check out the other side before we go in. I want to get a grace before I go back to the old uh, tunnel area. Honestly, I might go back to the the round table area because uh, I want to check with um, uh, Huey Lewis about upgrading that spike thing and putting poison on it, if at all possible. I do also want to go back to the, the Volcano Manor to get my reward. I'm hoping it's not another spell. No offense. Not really doing spells. Aside from maybe buffing. And the glintstones that I did earlier, which were kind of, you know, very helpful. If I can't put poison on the, the, the mace, I might still upgrade it because it has blood loss on it. Hello? Are you coming over here? You're coming over here. Alright. Hi, how's it going? Look, I'm sorry, okay? You didn't have to fight me, just so we're clear. Thank you for the, the neat rapier and the mask? And the robe! You don't bleed, huh? That makes sense. You're a giant stone golem. I think I just knocked your ass down, actually. No, I didn't. Thought I... Uh, yeah, now I did. Give me your heart. The heart, Osborne! The heart! Thank you. Ooh, Smithing Stone 5. I should probably check out that stuff, huh? I used the rapier on one of my playthroughs for Dark Souls 1 way back in the day. It might have been my first one. I might have used the S-Stock for a long time until we got Rickard's rapier. Um, Alright. I, I realized much later that, like, Quaylog's Fury was a lot better. Actually, elementally enhanced weapons were also really, really good back in the day, given the fact that... Well, they weren't nerfed back then. They're actually really, really good. I nerfed them later on, though, which was kind of a shame. Um, where is this mask? Right here? Like, the 
Dreadlocks? Mask of an image of a white-haired young noble custom customarily worn by the head of the house, uh, Marius? Increases arcane. Really? By how much? By one. Well, I mean, it does cover up my beautiful face, though, so I'm not really sure I want that. Uh, has a dual history spanning generations, serving as both executioners and Castlian Castellans? Of the Shady Castle? I don't really know what that is. This mask bears the likeness of the first of the air. Uh, cool. Uh, robe? Robe. Uh, the sons of house are all sickly born. Maris. Maris? Yeah. Little wonder that would be, uh, Malia Maris would be beguiled by the beautiful and fierce goddess who was born at the rot. Okay. I don't know what that means. Did you give me pants? Or gloves? Or just the rapier. I think you just gave me the rapier. Yeah, this thing. Uh, ooh, Scarlet Rot buildup. Really? Spur of the giant ant who has been fashioned into a rapier. The blade drips with Scarlet Rot. Scarlet Rot is an old legend which uh, Ma Ma Malia Mar Maris of the Shady Castle was a private believer. Indeed, he eventually found his own personal goddess. Huh. And it can be just straight up upgraded, huh? With like bleed, too. Man, okay. <laughs> I need to find a grace. Is there grace in here? Well, hopefully. Because we're in now. Uh, are we going to be dealing with Scarlet Rot? Because, I mean, that would make sense given the whole, uh, we just got a Scarlet Rot rep weapon. Hmm. What was the other thing? Was the other person that we just fought uh, using a, a rapier of the same kind? Because if we can get two rapiers that do Scarlet Rot, I'm just saying, might have to do a little weapon swapping. Okay, that's clearly poison. Hi, buddy. I'm not gonna go over there just yet. Okay, well, I saw a ladder over there. Oh, okay, we can't... Trump down. Lovely. You don't need to do that. You don't need to do that. You don't need to do that. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's Scarlet Rod, of course. Smithing Stone 5. Bye bye. Okay, so we don't want to be Scarlet Rotted. We have some cures for it. It sucks, though. Don't want to deal with it. Poison, not that bad. Just heal it. Oh, motherfucker. Thank you for dying. Though, you guys respawn, right? So I need to, uh, leave! I need to leave. Don't roll. If you roll, it sticks to you. But you can run! Hello? Oh, I like your armor, dog. Give me your armor? You're not gonna give me your armor, are you? I guess if I killed you enough, you might drop it. Oh, speaking of which... I like your dagger, too? Pretty dope. Oh, give me your shit. Ah. Oh, five times the experience. Which isn't that much. Uh, I'm assuming I should have been here much earlier. 
Like maybe when we first got to the plateau. I mean, look, it's an open world game, right? It just happens. Oh, god damn it. It just happens sometimes. Drink. Kill. Okay. Get out of there. So their puke is very rude. Their puke has like worms, leeches. Drop your shit, please. <sighs> I mean, it's just disappointing, right? I'm disappointed, so I'm assuming everyone else is disappointed, too. Ah, shit, Basilis. And then, like... Oh, damn it. Stairs. Oh, that just goes down there. Giant slugs. Do I want to go to Basil's land right now, or do I want to go back over here and run up there? I guess either way, I could probably backtrack. Yeah, okay. So first things first, I'm going to go kill this douchebag. Because he's a douchebag! Does this lead into the building? It leads into the building. So doesn't... Actually, this might not. Oh, I really gotta go back to Stormvale. Apparently I missed some stuff there, and... There's also that lion there that I want to kill, just in case it has something good there. Are you all bell-ringing assholes? There's a Grace over there. Oh, shit. Thought it was flying for a second. Let's go get that grace, let's go get the grace, and kill all of you. Bye bye Did you drop anything? No. Hi. You did drop something, actually. Don't do that! Stop ringing that bell! It's not dinner time! It might be dinner time, actually. That'd be kind of nice. Oh, I could go for some hot wings. But that requires me to buy hot sauce and chicken wings. A good purchase nonetheless, but... Do I really want to go to the store again? I do need coffee, actually, so maybe... Uh, priorities, premise. Uh, I know. Actually, I need a coffee grinder, because the coffee... I used to grind my own coffee for my uh, cold brew thing. When I started buying bagged ones, and the, the bagged pre-ground coffee is just... It's, it's not really working too well with the, the cold brew thing. And uh, I need to go back to grinding my own. But, here's the thing. I went to go grind my own the other day, and the, the grinder just does not work anymore. <laughs> I don't know what happened. It's really annoying. Now I have to buy coffee. Because I'm addicted. If I don't get it, I get grumpy. And a headache, actually. Maybe, maybe the headache is the worst. I mean, you can just wean yourself off caffeine currently, yeah, but why would I want to do that? Just give up my reason for waking up in the morning. Probably should have looked before I walked off there, but hey, it worked out fine. Last shard? Oh my god. Really? Can I walk in down here? Yeah. I don't even need to crouch. I don't even think that has any effect on it. Oh, it's a painting. I really need to do these. 
Champion song painting. You've been saying that since the first painting, Kronos. Yeah, I know, but I'm a liar. I got nothing else to follow up on that one. I'm just a goddamn liar. Alright, so we've done the outskirts except Basilisk Land. And this. Really? Where do I go for this? Oh, I'll jump over here. Man, I never thought there would be a day where the platforming in uh, a Souls-like game from From Software actually was fairly decent. Not perfect! I don't think I can make that from here. Yeah, there might be a way around it, but... Ah, man. Let's check out over here. I don't want to waste too much time on it. Um... No, I don't know. Oh, there I go. Falling. In love again. With this poison swamp. You know what, let's just go up this ladder over here. Where's the ladder? Where am I? <laughs> Wait a minute. This isn't my world. Ah, the ladder's over here. We could go to Basilisk Town, that's true. Alright, so we saw that. Oh, this is Basilisk Town. Alright, I get ya. Guess we didn't have. Oh my god, you're. Very green. I, oh, you're all green. You do poison and curse? That's just not cool. I apparently rolled? I must have rolled. Did I roll or did you just get me cursed? And by cursed, I mean poisoned. Okay, it's not actually going up anymore, so I think I'm fine. There's that ladder. Weren't you going to teleport out, Kronos, and, like, go check out the hammer stuff? Well, not hammer, but the mace. Now, uh, before we go in that tunnel, because clearly it's a mine, there's going to be hard enemies in there, so we may as well uh, do that then. Right now, I don't think we have to worry too much about it. Like, we're, we're, we're doing all right here. There's ample enemies that are just dying in one hit to me, so... You know, it makes me feel good, and I don't want to change that right now. How the hell have we not got in this place yet? Like, did I miss the door? Oh, is it that over there? Huh, okay. Hi guys, how's it going? If you're in my way, I will kill you. Because, like... You know, you're assholes. There you go, buddy. You know... Did you fall? You fell. Great! Good job! Glad you fell. You're a rotten knight. You're dead. God, I hate rotten knights. Armor might be cool, though. Uh, Valkyrie's prosthesis? Uh, pros pros it's a fake arm. Key item as well. Golden prosthesis. Once used by the one-armed Valkyrie, Masterwork Craftsman with practice and skill can be used as proficiently as a real arm when Amelia uh, Maris, Lord of the Shady Castle, embraces... Pro prothesis. He uh, claimed to feel the presence of his golden goddess. Okay. Sure. Can I cut off my arm and put that? No, 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 no. Let's not do that. We don't want to cut off our own arm. We could. Godric did it. 
And then he got a dragon head on his arm. We don't want to be showed up. It's not even like it's a dragon head, it's just a, a fake arm. That apparently works like a normal arm. Which, I really hope they actually get, like... I know they're working on it, and I know they've made, uh, like, really cool advancements for prosthetics that are, like... Just, not lifelike, but they can move and stuff when they're attached to your nerves and stuff like that. That's really cool. And hopefully one day they get that. Like, just get that down where people that have, I don't know, were born with one arm or lost an arm in an accident or anything... Just can... I don't know, just get some... Well, yeah, it is kind of normalcy. If they, if they grew up with both the extremities and they was lost in an accident, yeah, get some more normalcy back, because that shit can weigh on a person's mind. Like, losing appendages? Uh, yeah. Now, obviously, it's a little different if you're born without one. It'd still probably be very handy to have, like, uh, both legs or both hands or arms. Uh, but... You know, if you're if you're born and just kind of raised with one, it's probably a lot more normal for you just to, oh god, 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 get out of there! What the hell? The hell was that? What are we trying to say here? Is that is like, oh god, like getting in like your full pension wouldn't probably like. I don't know. Be as big a deal as compared to someone that lost them. It'd still probably be really good given how everything in the world is like designed. But you probably wouldn't like, I don't know. <laughs> go into debt trying to get it. Not saying that that should ever really happen, right? Debt medical debt is a bitch. As someone who's had to take care of his mother's medical debt and do all that paperwork, and then have the insurance companies try to decline a goddamn uh, hospital stay payment because uh, you didn't put in, like, get a reference for the emergency brain fucking aneurysm she had. Oh, 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 oh. oh they ended up paying for it. Uh, I definitely was on the phone for a little while for that, but they definitely ended up paying for it. Which is nice, because it was like $170,000. Which was brought down to still a lot, but a manageable amount. Oh, we're back here. Yeah, medical debt is uh, something else sometimes. Geronimo? I missed horribly. Can you come back, please? Okay. I'm gonna come over here real fast and heal myself. Thank you. Yoink. Well. I guess I'll go this way. If he doesn't want to fight me, I'm not gonna make him fight me. His brother over here, though. Oh, he's gonna get it. After I come up this ladder. Golden Rune full. Oh, Grace. That's cool. I'm not gonna sit at it just yet. I don't want these idiots respawning. Just checking. I thought I saw movement. Uh, I think it was a shadow, but I swoop puppy. Pu puppy, no. Puppy, die. Thank you. Thoughts. Uh, House Maris is ruined. Just, just desserts are falling for the severed harpy. For that severed harpy? No surprise that guilty Cretan took the castle in our storied sword. Is it the rapier that I have? I gotta go kill this guy over here. Cause that was the guy from the, the text, yeah? 
The one with the golem? I don't know how he got a golem on his side. Kind of jealous about that. Nice hair. Pretty sure it's just the helmet. We've been there before. Really? Just really? Just really. Dick. Just dick. At least they don't do give you rot, right? That would be awful. That'd be hilarious, actually. Would it be awful? Okay, where's that horseman? Oh my god. Ow, 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 ow. No, no, no. I refuse. I refuse to die. Okay, well. That's that's fine. Fuck. Oh, okay. Mr. Horseman of the Apocalypse. You gotta get those souls back. Well, at least we get that other grace, right? So we don't have to go all the way back. I want their their crown. I really do want a crown to wear on my lovely little head. Can I have my horse? No, okay. Just double checking. I saw that you had your horse and I was like, cool. We can get horses. Gotta remember though that the game is a filthy cheat. You know what? Come at me, bro. Yeah, that's right. Alright, well, you know, that was my bad. Actually, I actually thought you were gonna fight me fair and square. There we go. Give me your crown. Damn it. The hell? You know what? Fine. I don't need any of your hacker shit anyways. Mr. Go Through Walls. Really? Using no clipping in an Elder Scrolls? Ow! Game. Is that it? Is that all that was over here? Oh, that's bullshit. All right, back over here, I guess. Can I upgrade my club? Probably, right? Hi, Venus, how's it going? Yeah, you hear me screaming at the NPC? I wasn't screaming, I was more of just loudly talking at. Hi, puppies. Oh my god, you're old school. You're old school too. Oh, Glenstone Staff. Give me your stuff? Hey, you actually gave me your stuff! I think I had your gloves already. Go up there. What does this lead? To a dog. And this guy. Never mind. I thought that was a guy. Oh, it's a rot knight. I'm gonna go up this ladder over here then. Yo, you know their scythes probably have rot, right? They cause rot when they hit you. <gasps> oh, where do they spawn? They spawn in that river. Could I get two rot knight scythes? One of them has a sword, don't they? Perfumer's Cookbook 2, Electric Boogaloo. What does that do? Hello? Perfumer's Cookbook. Oh, it's my only one. Poison, Spray Mist, Blood Boil, Aromatic. Cool. I don't know what those do, but we could probably check it out. Actually, right now. I was going to say at the bonfire, but... Um... Ah, here. So, uh... State of Fervor. Fimrata Depraved Perfumers. Craftable with perfume bottles. 
uses FP to enter a temporary state of fervor, raising maximum attack power and stamina while increasing attack uh, damage received. Okay. Uh, even upon the battlefield, do not fear being wounded. Uh, do you fear being wounded? Take a good look. Your limbs are frozen stiff. And then poison spray miss. Hell of mouth. Uh, it was once a restored heart. Release a poison miss from the user mouth. Okay, that's cool. We can make seven of these. I got seven perfume bottles? Good lord. Bug. Bug? Oh! Wait, no. Kind of, actually. Yeah, that's a bug. <laughs> that is definitely a bug. I, I was, like, looking for, like, uh... Art of War... Oh, God! Sorry, I didn't know you came in here. Drop your armor and so sword. Oh, my God. Yeah, drop all your stuff. Whatever, whatever gives rot. That'd be pretty sick. We're getting to the creepy part of the castle, huh? Okay, that's where we were earlier. Ambush head. Oh, I don't think so. I ambushed him. <laughs> Gold firefly. Ow. One second. That hurt. Don't do that again. Goodbye. Is that a lady? I don't think I noticed those things were ladies. Pack ahead all the more night. Oh, God. Get the hell over here, you dick. Also, drop your sword. Oh, okay. Didn't really expect that. My god. Don't be an asshole. You know what? I'm going downstairs. You can't stop me. Dog, come down here first, please. Also, I just noticed that you don't build up rot. And I gotta admit... The hell is... Why not? Clean rot gauntlets. Well, okay. I'm assuming they have horrible rot protection. Oh god. Dog. <laughs> okay. Clean rot gauntlets. Uh, Gauntlets of the Clean Rot Knights, uh, celebrated for their undefeated campaign in the Shattering. The Clean Rot Knights vowed to fight alongside uh, Malia, Mal Malina. Malia, Malina, Malnia. Sure. Despite the inevitable, if gradual, pure uh, petr putrefaction of their flesh, their acceptance of their fate made the battles the fiercest. Um. Uh, well. No, I don't need those. Any others around here want to drop me their weapons? Or... Honestly, they used... They did cause... Oh, maybe it was just the ground we were fighting them on. Right? The ground was causing rot? Probably. Just checking. Kick ladder. Okay, so that goes back to the entrance. Who checked over here, yeah? Yeah, alright, cool. Well, up we go, I guess. Why... Why does my hair look like that? Okay, it looks better now. That was weird. Oh, boss. There's Merica's statue thingy. Friend ahead. Time for friendship. What? That is not a friend. 
Oh, you're the dude from the shack. Ow. Okay, back up. Back up. Back up and heal, please. Thank you. Ow. Well, that's unfortunate. Don't do that. Do this instead. Ow. Okay. Rude. Can I have your sword? And your armor? And your ability to swing the sword around like that? Because that's kind of sick, dog. You're not bleeding as much as I would like you to. Okay, never mind. Uh, Maris Executioner Sword. And Briar Great Shield. Is that it? Oh, that's that lady from the intro. That's probably, uh, Malnia, right? Malina? Probably Malina. I don't know. Um, okay, so... Let's check out that sword. Here? It's a great sword. Uh, Dancing Blade. Diffuse the sword with energy, then fling it forward in a corkscrew attack. The sword continuously deals damage while violently spinning. Charge the attack to increase reach of duration. Okay, cool. I guess we're done here? Yeah, I guess we're done here. Alright, let's come back here. And, uh... Got nothing to buy, so we should probably level up, huh? I don't think we have anything to buy. I bought all that dude's freaking incantations, you know what happened? Nothing. Dick. How much experience did that guy give me? Like, 30,000? Wow, that's... Not much. There's something you should know. Oh, okay, never mind, Rodericka. Thank you. Well, I've been hiding out. I thought you were dead. Uh, let's see. So, come over here. This. I could wield this, because it's the same as this. But it has blood loss. I mean, I could put blood loss on this as well, I guess. Oh, okay, so I can't put... Okay, I can put poison over here? Okay. You lose 25 attack. That's not great. Quick step. <laughs> um, ooh, Earthshaker might work. Yeah. Okay, and then we'll come over here. I need Smithing Stones 1? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, shit, I just, I just used all my goddamn soul. Well, I got 31,000, never mind. So I need 12 of those, 12 twos, and 12 threes. God, I hope we have more than that. So, oh, okay, so I can buy up to fours. So, 12, 12, 10, 7. Yeah, I mean, that was a lot of money. I have runes. I have runes. And use that. Might need to use more. Okay, dog. Let's, uh... Back already. Nice. Yeah, I know. I needed to get my stuff. Come over here. So this could be my new weapon of choice when it comes to, uh... Dealing with the hard bros. How much is this costing? It's actually costing a fair amount. I need more souls. Oh, we can get this up to four. Yeah, no, we'll keep doing this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we'll keep doing these ones. 
I don't know if that's going to be enough. Back over it. I'm at Actually, one second. I need sevens for those. Okay. So we can get this one up to plus 15. And then we can get it up to uh, plus 16, which is pretty good. Yeah. Maybe we should do like a spin the wind type move, like a fast attack. Because Earthshake is probably really good. Wild Strike is probably really good too. Lion Kick, Roar, Slam. Ah, uh, yeah. You know what? Let's just keep it with Earthshaker for now. And uh, grab that thing, and then we'll go to uh, that cave. So we can still use this this way, yeah. Oh, we can't do that here. That's fine. Here. Old Altus Cave, or Tunnel. These usually aren't that bad, so we'll, we'll do it today, in this episode. Because why not? We're on kind of a roll. Has the same moveset as the other one. Okay. What am I looking at here? Oh, there's a mine, bro. Oh, oh, puppy. Good thing about these types of weapons, you can actually just, like, pivot mid-air. I mean, Smithing Stone 5 is... not great. We need 7s for, like, our Twin Blade. So, yeah. We can jump down there. What was that? Be wary of a dog. That staggers him, too. Bolt Talisman. Oh, hello! Honestly, was... Oh, we poisoned him! Wow! That poison buildup is amazing. I should probably put that jump attack charm if I'm just going to keep jump attacking, right? Spending stone five, yeah. This way, okay. Looks like we got to jump down. That was how that that felt good. I wonder if Earthshaker puts the poison on. Maybe? Oh, there's a ladder right there. I don't need no stinking ladder. Okay, apparently it didn't need to be up here either. Oh god. Ow. Oh, we go, we got it. Okay. Okay. Sorry, I thought you guys would be not normal dudes for the most part. Oh, God. Okay, well. I need to leave. I need to leave. I need to leave. You know what? You're right. That does put poison on. That totally put poison on him. Yo, that's sick. <laughs> uh, Sombering, Somber Smithing Stone 4. Man, I guess I really should have came here a lot earlier, huh? Sorry, item ahead. Is it necessary, though, or is it completely useless? Ambush ahead. Just checking.
That's gonna be fire. This is gonna be fire. This is gonna be fire, puppy. Apparently, you're immune to fire, puppy. Okay. Well, you're being a dick, dog. Dog, you're being a dick. You're being a dick. Okay. Neat. That was not necessary item ahead. Yeah, that was not necessary item. Maybe you meant this way. Okay, I see ya. Troll's hammer! Okay. That's cool. I mean, I kinda get this spiky boy and it's working fairly good. Oh, hello. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't know you were here. Giant sword ahead. Weak foe ahead. Oh, okay. Stone digger troll. Oh, this guy again, huh? Hey. How do you feel about bleed and poison? Oh, my God. Oh god, give me something good. Giant club. Is that it? Okay. Is that really it? Okay. Well. Yo, poison and bleed build up apparently pretty good. I'm just gonna go on a limb there and say that. Uh, let's switch back to our twin blades. That dude give us gave us not even like ten thousand experience points. That is that true? Is that wow? Um. Wow. Okay. <laughs> I see you've performed another task for us. I know. Here is your usual. It was a little while ago. Please. Take it. A serpent bone blade. Now, perhaps the time has come to tell you. Okay. The true ruler of this manor. Lord Rikard. Is that guy? The Erd Tree blessed the tarnished with grace. But it was all too meager in the face of the enormity of their task. The tarnished were forced to scavenge, squabbling for crumbs, like the shard bearers vying for power in the wake of the shattering. Our lord, indignant, has refused to scurry about, fighting over what miserly scraps they allow us. Okay. If the Erd tree, and indeed the very gods, would debase us so, then we are willing to raise the banner of resistance even if it means heresy. We at the Volcano Manor, under Lord Rikard, have sworn no rest until it is done. If you follow this heroic path, one day the Lord will see you. Sweet. The Lord's visits with our champions are always a spectacle. It cannot come a day too soon. <laughs> Anything else? If you follow this okay, I'm gonna go talk to everyone. Assuming I have another, like, target, which would be nice. Oh, nope, that's the guy I looted earlier. I was like, wait a minute, I don't remember killing anyone in there. Hello? Ooh. I can't target you. Hi. Brave Tarnished. What? What is your business here? I'm afraid this is not a guest room. What's that peculiar look upon your face? Goodness, am I still a serpent? Yeah! Oh, how dreadful. How dreadful indeed. Oh, forgive my distress. I ought to be thanking you for treating me as usual. Despite I couldn't target you, that's the only reason. Brave Tarnished, this is my true form. 
My real name is Zarias. Please forgive the deception. No. Do you understand? This duplicity is my own doing. Lady Tanith speaks no falsehoods. And the Volcano Manor is just as it seems. Okay. Lady Tanith is my mother. Oh. I am told I was born by the grace of a glorious king. I have doubts about that one. cherishes this form I inhabit. I am proud of what I am. But people are cruel. If they saw my true form, they wouldn't speak to me. They'd probably try to kill you. Um, so, I assume a guise when seeking new recruits. But you are not like the rest. My serpentine form and the name I gotta check out that blade. were secrets. Known only to Lady Tanith and I. If you attack me, I will kill you. Secrets with you as well. Please keep them safe from anyone else. You know the door is open, right? People can just come in and see this shit. Serpentine for a secret. Now I said, please keep them. All right, you might want to close the door then. I'm just saying. Uh oh, it's a katana. Double slash. That's a good. That's a good move. Uh, it costs a poison buildup. Oh, it's a special weapon as well, actually. I can equip it, shockingly. Well, then again, yeah, it is a katana, and that's mostly deck stuff, huh? It's the intelligence ones that I can't really do. Is there a door down here? Try gesturing. What's the gesture? Um, I have that gesture, don't I? Not that one. Uh, switch to... By my sword? No, 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 no. Oh, uh, this one? I don't think that worked. That was the gesture. Apparently I didn't open this door. Oh, it's the other door. Hello. A red letter. Ooh. Hello. Look at you. A recusant through and through. I knew you had it in you. Take this. Uh, okay. A special invitation to hunt some of the first tarnished who sat at the round table hold. If you should accept... I'll next see you on the field of battle. Cool. You still a lot? Give me the new? No. All right. Well. Bye bye. Uh, let's check out that stuff. So we get red letter. Juno Hoslo, Knight of Blood. He can be found at the mountaintops of giants. Okay. Haven't been there yet. And Vergram, the Rage of Work, Errant Sorcerer Wilhelm, Royal Capital of Lindell. Okay, we can go do that one, I guess, next time, right? Because we've already been oh, here. Okay, cool. That's going to be easy one. The other one is going to be those ones. Yeah, all right, cool. That's going to be it for this episode. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all next time. Have a great day. Bye.